So basically what you got when you enter into the Calvin College uh, environment, you got those who come from outside. They're part of the CRC, but they're outside like missionary kids and then some from Canada, things like that. Some of them have uh, working class roots. Others sometimes maybe professional sons or daughters of professionals of one sort or another, but still some kind of kind of quasi working class professionals, like missionary kids. And, you know, some of them are kind of a little rugged, less learned, less academic more evangelical missionary uh, trial and error types. I mean, I'm not putting that down. That's kind of like I am too, although I come from an academic background, past son of a pastor, grandson of a pastor, nonetheless. Uh, but what you get is kind of a pathetically sad agenda from some and it's kind of a fundamentalist quasi fundamentalist but also it's infatuated with this sort of uh, trying to, to gain climb the ladder by despicably, disgustingly proving that you're celibate through obesity or other shenanigans, I would say, shenanigans, call it shenanigans, until you get to the point where you're just like, those who are not playing that game, usually those who grow up in a healthy Grand Rapids Christian Reformed Christian school environment or other healthy Christian school Christian Reformed doesn't even not, not necessarily just Christian Reformed but I mean that's where a lot of the students come from uh, uh, the healthy ones get so disgusted by it they, they leave and so you get those who remain are those who have gained the system through some kind of despicable, disgusting form of proving your celibacy via obesity or other other ways of game. So really, just gaming the system. Steve DeVries comes to mind as one, and. Uh, DeVries or Steve something. I think it's not the, Yeah, I think it is DeVries. Anyways, uh, it's really just uh, kind of sad the, the way they game the system that way and just through obesity or other, other means. And uh, it actually perverted, perverted the Christian Reformed Church. So much so that I just decided I, I didn't want to be part of it anymore. I, I mean, I my Christian community can still can include the Christian Reformed Church, but not. Uh, but through prayer and more of the invisible church rather than the visible church, and those show those who show up on Sundays just to prove their uh, celibacy to obesity, but that's no way to live, and that's not what Jesus intended, I mean, it's just perverting the church, really, so you don't want to be in part of that, you got to get out of it.